share your unique and special holiday traditions. And now, all week, we are sharing your stories. And this one in particular caught our eye. The often forgotten population during the holidays are those in our prison system. And I met a local volunteer with the Prison Fellowship, which is the country's largest prison ministry, who brings the sounds of Christmas to what is often a very lonely, dark place. Whom angels greet with an thump sweet one. With CDs and performances spanning nearly 20 years, Detroit recording artist and pastor Rufus Harris admits of all the genres of music he likes to perform, Christmas music was never one of them. No intention ever of doing any kind of a Christmas album at all. But seeing how business was always slow for him this time of year, he decided if you can't beat him, join him. released Come and Listen, Songs of the Savior in 2006. So I did a Christmas album and that opened up doors. Prison doors. Rufus started bringing his guitar to prisons across Michigan and the country with the Prison Fellowship Organization. We do special concerts at Christmas time in prison. Oh, bring him incense gold. He performs at Milan Federal Prison in Milan, Michigan, and Women's Huron Valley Correctional Facility in Ypsilanti. Songs that they're familiar with, that they enjoy listening to. Bringing the sounds of the season to the men and women that spend their holidays year after year behind bars. We go there to, to be a comfort to them. If a person has been in prison for more than 10 years, a lot of times their family they're done. Prison is a very dark place. There's not a whole lot of hope there. But his music joy to the world. helps restore some of that hope. There's hope, there's joy. There, there's actually a peace that happens there. And gratitude. One of the ladies at Huron Valley, she said that uh, she really thanked us for loving them so much. Pastor Harris not only makes frequent prison visits during the holidays, he voluntarily comes back and performs all year round. Why? The church is supposed to remember those who are in prison. It's like they have a need and just our being there meets the need. While giving him something, he needs to. Haze to bring him praise. The we always come out refreshed and very happy that we went. And Rufus Harris and his wife spread that joy outside of the prisons, too. They host Fourth Fridays. It's a Christian artist and musician project known by its acronym, CAMP, C-A-M-P, at the Ford Community and Performing Arts Center in Dearborn. It's every fourth Friday, and admission is just $10. And if wow. you're interested in his CD, he has a website in his name, Rufus Harris, and I really like it. It's That's kind of, great. it's our own little take on yeah. all of the different traditional songs like Silent Night, Joy to the World, but um, yeah, he's got a really great is. voice. Mm -hmm. Great he does. voice. And a great spirit, too. He's a yeah. really awesome person. It was fun to meet him. So.